I just got done training legs and I can barely walk. <laughs> So today's video is three tips for people just starting out in bodybuilding, fitness, changing your body uh, for the better, whatever, that sort of thing, training. So tip number one, find a program and stick to it. And what I mean by that is find any program that's been proven to work. Don't be looking for like the secret to you know, super fast gains or buy this ebook for 1099 because this guy is jacked and he obviously knows what he's talking about. You know, just, just go on bodybuilding.com or um, starting strength, dog crap, any of those uh, training programs and just choose one. And like I said, it, there's, a, there's a bunch of free ones on bodybuilding.com. You can, you can literally just find one for whatever you want muscle gain fat loss whatever and stick to it and don't change it up don't try and second guess yourself and you know uh, switch between them week to week just just find one and stick to the program don't add in your own things don't change it up just just do it and that's the that's a very important thing for beginners I think is just consistency because because that's where the gains come from at the end of the day if you're doing anything, if you're, I mean, if it's like a powerlifting program, if it's more volume, if it's Dorian Yates style intensity, uh, if it's um, full body workouts, if it's a body part split, whatever it is, it's gonna work if you stick to it, most likely. Um, and it's the, it's the same with nutrition. Um, don't be, you know, oh, now I'm low carb and now I'm, I'm gonna cut and then bulk and then, just, just stick to it, just be consistent. So that's tip number one. Tip number two is pace yourself and don't burn out. So the number of times I have seen beginners and, and I'll, I'll see it with, you know, I, I've had friends come to me and say, oh Tom, can you write me a program? And I'm like, yeah, sure. Sit down and do the diet, the training, sort everything out for him, show him how to do it in the gym. And then with it, they'll, they'll go to the gym, you know, six days a week and twice a day sometimes and, and they'll do it for, two, three, four weeks and then give up because they either, either hurt themselves or they just burn out. So start small, start just to go uh, three times a week to start out with, okay? And, and build up slowly and don't immediately overhaul all of your diet. Just make some small changes at first maybe and, and build up and don't immediate, don't go from zero, a standing start to doing Jay Cutler's Olympia prep program because it doesn't work that way. You have to, you, you build up, you gradually add volume, you gradually change your diet. Um, and, and that's the key to long term because this, this should be a lifestyle thing. You shouldn't sort of crash diet or cra like kind of crash exercise where you do loads for six weeks and then never do it again. Um, it's consistency. So build up, be slow about it. Final tip is don't pay attention to anyone else. So when you're in the gym and, 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 and a lot of people, when, when you ask them, you, they'll say, oh, I want to go to the gym, but, and there's that but. The but is they're worried that people are going to judge them. Um, you know, there's these massive dudes in the gym that they're going to get judged or, you know, there's uh, girls that are fitter than them that are going to look at their butt and think, oh, my butt isn't that flat and you shouldn't be here. But what? Like, at the end of the day, let, let's just say that was the case and there were people in the gym looking at you and judging you for being there, so fucking what? Um, you're there to change your body, you're doing, you're doing it for you. Um, but the truth is, no, one, like, no one's paying attention. Um, no, no one's probably even gonna notice you're there. Okay, just go in, do your thing, and everyone starts somewhere. Okay, Arnold Schwarzenegger at one point was a skinny farm boy in Austria no one knew who he was and he didn't ha no no one is born with muscle okay you, you have to work for it and it's it's one of those things that holds so many people back 
you know, what, what, worrying what other people will think. When, <laughs> when you're like 80 and you're thinking back on your life, you don't want to be thinking, oh, I wish I hadn't worried what people thought and just did what I wanted to do. Uh, so do it. No one's looking at you, just, just do your thing. And also don't, I mean, genetics and things like that play a part. So, and, and also so does time. So if you're thinking, oh, I've been training eight weeks and I don't look like Steve Cook or Sergi Constance or whoever, it, fine, just, just keep going. And maybe, you, you know, you're two years into it and you're not where you want to be, but you're better than where you were that's important it, it's it, measure your goals by you and measure your progress by you don't listen to what anyone else says don't compare yourself to anyone else and don't care what anyone else thinks okay if you lose um, five pounds in uh, two months okay uh, because you're doing weight loss and a lot of people would say that's not enough you should be losing one to two pounds a week whatever you've, you've lost you've lost five pounds that's an achievement for you so be happy with that and keep going. Um, so yeah, three tips for beginners and I hope that was in some way useful. Facebook, YouTube, subscribe, Instagram, all that stuff. Catch you next time.